they're, they're often involving projects overseas in developing countries. So instead of building a new uh, coal-fired power station, someone will put in a wind farm instead. And because wind farms produce far, far less carbon than a, than a coal-fired power station, people are given carbon credits for spending that extra money in that reason. So there are also areas where tips have been capped. They capture the methane from the tips. Uh, they burn that methane to produce power and that also generates a carbon credit. That's done in, even in Melbourne, it's done in many places around the world. Sometimes they put pipes into the landfill, into the tip, and the, they draw the methane into the pipes. They then clean up the gas a bit and then burn it in a pa little power station and create electricity. And the reason they do this is methane's a very powerful greenhouse gas, 21 times more potent than carbon dioxide over 100 years. So if you burn methane to create energy, and even though you're producing a bit of carbon dioxide, there's still a very big difference in, in the, what we call the global warming potential. Mm -hmm.